First of all, just talk about what it is, what it's like to compete in your first, you know, state meet uh, as as a para amateur athlete. Um, it's nerve wracking. Uh, like so many more people in the stands, especially you know you're going up against the best, and so. I mean, what is it like? And it, now, some of the events you're competing by yourself, some of the, you're competing against other para amatory athletes. What is it like when you have to actually, you know, when you're still competing against somebody? Um, well, when I'm, um, I actually don't have much pressure. When, um, uh, but when I'm by myself, it's actually do better. But, uh, it's also good to have somebody else to like, pace off of and see how you're doing. Now, you're, you're obviously competing to try and get certain scores or certain times certain distances or things like that so you're kind of not even competing against yourself sometimes you still you still have that there's times in your mind so how do you kind of balance that one? how do you try and, and you know that you have those times in your head how does that help you compete um, most of them I know I'm really close to the uh, standards mm -hmm. so I just push myself because I, I just need a little bit more right. to get it what is tell me about getting into track and field and, and, and how, how did that happen and when did that start happening for you um, my prosthetist actually she recommended me for gumbo games mm -hmm. games united mind and body and so that's how I started and I wasn't uh I wasn't really serious at first about it. It took me a few years to actually start really yeah. practicing and striving for better. But once I started, uh, once I started really practicing, got much better, and I was going up from there. What is what is your your ultimate goals? Uh, where do you actually? We talked about that obviously the the Paralympic Games. What are your ultimate goals, and when do you want to try and compete on you know, on an international level? Hopefully, I'll go to the 2020 Paralympics in Tokyo, and so I mean, that's my goal right now. And now, and what's the, the, I mean, there's a lot of more games for you the rest of the summer. There's a meet for you tomorrow. Right. Tell me a little bit about what's the, what's your, what, what is, you know, next for you and what's your summer like? Um, well, I have three meets over the summer plus trials. So it'll be very busy. Um, yeah. So ma mainly I have to just focus on practicing and keep getting better. All right.